guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a bit of a vlog going for you. And we're gonna start off strong. We are gonna make coolicles. Think Kool-Aid meets pickles. I mean, that's reality what it is. I believe they started in Mississippi. I'm a little sh shady, foggy on that. So I first heard about these on if you ever watch the cooking network alton brown years ago did a um i'm just gonna open the jar did a um series not his um good eats but where he took his motorcycle and drove around the united states and tried regional food i'm just draining off the pickle juice so one of his stops was in mississippi and he tried coolicles. So cool, K O O L, and then pickles, coolicles. So, and I remember this show and going, oh, I would really love to try that, blah, blah. So you get this much pickle juice. Here, I'm going to turn you down so you can watch while I talk. And don't look at my dishes that are drying. Okay. So. And then I kind of forgot about them. Well, all over the TikTok, people are making them. And I want them. So here's the thing. The original coolicles are made with a packet of Kool-Aid, the amount of sugar and pickle juice instead of water. And then you pour them back over your pickles and you let them sit. And they're like a sweet and salty thing. Well, I don't, I can't have that because I can't have Kool-Aid, but I can have these sugar-free drink mixes, which we all know I buy all the time. I just don't know the proportion. So I believe the woman that I saw doing it on TikTok was using a bigger jar of pickles and had much more juice than I have. So I'm going to try two packages. I'm just using Fruity Punch because that's what I have. Although I can imagine cherry would be the bomb and probably the original. But on TikTok, they're making them in all different flavors. So that's what we're going to do. So I'm making... Let me put this in the trash. A very potent Kool-Aid here, basically. So we're gonna mix it up. Yeah, that looks good. And it's just pickle juice and two packets of Crystal White, any flavor or whatever, Kool-Aid brand, anything you wanna try. And I better bring this over here because I have a feeling we're gonna be spilling. So then I just have my jar of pickles and we're going to pour this juice right back over them. Crazy. I'm, oh, well, that's not good. It didn't, it didn't dissolve all the way, which I can't imagine why it didn't want to dissolve in the pickles. I think that's good enough. And obviously, if I think this is not sweet enough, then I can always add more. But they have to sit, I'm assuming, ooh, okay. Several hours, I knew that was gonna happen. Several hours to overnight. In the refrigerator, obviously, because I just opened them. So that is what the juice looks like. And the pickles will, I mean, it's already starting to change their color. So they will absorb this sweet juice into this briny pickle. And hopefully they're going to be delicious. But of course, I will taste it with you. So I'm going to put them in the fridge and leave them overnight. And we will try one tomorrow together. Okay, guys, I'm getting a paper towel. We have a treat to try. Coolicles. I'm scared and excited at the same time. All right, I've opened them up. I'm gonna get a fork. These are spears. I did see on Alton Brown's show <clears throat> that some of the stores had full, full, uh, Pickles. Fruit punch. 
with a bit of a kick. Next time, maybe I'll just use one packet of Crystal Light. Mmm. That's good. Sweet and sour. Mmm. I'm going to enjoy these. And I hope you enjoyed coming along with me while I made them. Mmm. That's delicious. Ooh, I wonder what a hard-boiled egg would taste like pickled in the juice after I eat the pickles. We'll have to try that too. All right, let's get moving on our day. Food. Haven't done this in a little while. Thought I would bring you along. I was at the grocery store and they had a decent price on country style spare ribs or pork ribs or whatever you guys call them. They were three, oh, $1.99 a pound on sale this week. So I said, well, we need that. I'm going to cook them on high on my crock pot because it's quarter of three and I want them done. If you're not familiar, these are, I mean, they're not even ribs, really. It's pork, some type of pork roast cut into a rib type fashion. All right. So we got them in there. Um, I mean, this, this is a lot of meat just so we're all aware, but I think it was pre-frozen or that's a bone. Oh, this is a bone. It's some of them are bone in. Okay, not a problem. I'm going to make teriyaki uh, flavor. Now, um, I don't typically eat teriyaki sauce because it's very high in sugar, but this is zero sugar by Kinder's uh, marinade and sauce teriyaki. I had about that much in this bottle. I added some hot water just to thin it out, and then I put two packets of my sweetener in it because I like it a little sweet and it works out really well. I have another bottle of this in case I need to add some more to the crock pot and I'm just pouring it in. I mean, all the seasonings that we need is right here in this bottle. Oh yeah, this will be plenty. And then when it comes out of the crock pot in a few hours, I may just throw it in the air fryer with a little barbecue sauce on it. We will see. That was it. And I got, um, I think I got this one at Big Lots, but Dollar Tree had these for a little while. Um, I like them, Kinder's brand. And then I'm just literally putting the lid on it. That's it. And I will have it on high for about four hours. I have it on the stove so I can tidy up around here. My house is a little bit on the messy side. I've been working all weekend. So now up is I'm going to go clean. Um, hi, and my rash is getting better. I'm going to go clean the bathroom. I have to clean the kitty litter out of there and I'm just going to let this go until they're done and tender. And this will be lunch for this week and some dinners. Also, I will have it for, um, cause I have to go to the office three times. So we have that. Um, so that is seasoning. I may add a little more teriyaki to the top. We'll see. But I'll be back. Yes, you made it. What do you 
It's her birthday, Michael. You're gonna be famous. I'm all about famous. Lucy and Riley.